Hello guys, good morning. Welcome to Ram's tutorial. So today guys, we're going to discuss about incorrect and incorrect sentences using English grammar. Please watch this video so that you will know how you are going to dis how you are going to use it and how you're going to apply it using different sentences. Once again, welcome back to Ram's tutorial. Hello everyone. Good day. Welcome back to Ram's tutorial. So today guys, we are going to discuss about English grammar and correct and correct sentences. What makes a sentence grammatically incorrect? Remember there are four main problems that prevent people from writing complete grammatically correct sentences. These problems include the sentence fragment, the run-on sentence, lack of subject verb and pronoun reference agreement and lack of parallel structure that's why this is what you call the most common what you call reasons why incorrect sentence incorrect sentences arrive talking about incorrect sentence remember guys incorrect sentence it is a sentence corrections or error spotting it is one of the most scoring area of verbal section in any competitive exam when we say guys competitive exam so you must read thoroughly the sentences and you are going to identify which sentence is correct and incorrect here is one example bambi is living far away with china Chiram, where's the way that might be incorrect for our sentence the way here the word with using with is the incorrect one why with is not the right word after with is china instead of with you can use from okay you can proceed it to the ones we're going to these incorrect sentences we're we are going to write it correct ones correct sentence in order for a sentence to be a grammatically correct the subject and verb must both be singular or plural or in other words class the subject and verb must agree with one another in their tense it means to say when your subject is singular your verb must be in a singular form when your subject is plural the verb must be in a plural form that is subject verb agreement class in order that your sentence is correct example we have bambi is living far away from china okay so with now is what we call change to from okay with then now is from okay so from incorrect so we can arrange it to correct ones bombi is living far away from china now that's the correct one sentence next okay remember my dear viewers we do this it's just because it's a lot of reasons some of the students also get mistakes it's just because you don't read it thoroughly the what you call sentences so this video guys will help you a lot and please watch this until the videos or until the end of our discussion having what we call talking about incorrect and correct sentences now we are going to proceed guys to our motivation process motivation and exercises for so when you said motivation exercises this is what you call it's highlight the correct ones okay that the sentence corrections highlighting the correct ones and we are going to find it out also the incorrect ones okay so we have first sentence we have let me know what is the matter when you see it guys let me know what is the matter remember this sentence is incorrect why it's just because of the word what is the matter is incorrect okay this is incorrect what is the matter now the right ones we have we're going to highlight okay 
we have the right is let me know what the matter is okay what the matter is that is the right word okay let me know what is what the matter is so it's quite different let me know what is the matter okay so this is the incorrect one okay and this is what you call the correct ones okay this is the correct grammar let me know what the matter is that's the correct second james is a matured man of 40. james is a matured man of 40. what word being this sentence incorrect what makes this sentence incorrect the word what you called matured okay so we are going to encircle because this is the incorrect ones the word matured instead of matured plus the right ones is james is a mature man of 40 so we're going to double it this is the right one so we're going to put a check that means to so say this is the right sentence the correct grammar from subject when the subject is singular the verb the special verb must be singular form okay james is a mature man of 40 we're referring for james okay whereas here in the second part the incorrect ones guys just because james is a matured man of 40 so the verb here is what you call in the past tense so whereas the subject is singular so the verb is special verb is in the present form so this grammatically incorrect guys it's just because of the word matured right okay so this is the right what we call answer for number two james is a matured man of 40. this is the right ones having a check with circle that is incorrect check is what we call the right ones <clears throat> three do you like to play the volleyball do you like to play the volleyball so this is incorrect sentences with the valley ball okay this is incorrect class do you like to play the volleyball because the right one is that this is the right one do you like to play volleyball okay so we have a valley ball so this is the incorrect ones class do you like to play volleyball we're asked as you can see in number three that this is the incorrect ones do you like to play the volleyball okay so this is what you call incorrect and the other side is the correct sentence four i do not know why did this happen so remember class when you read it i do not know why did this happen so this one guys why did this happen mix sentence and correct why instead of using did why did this happen so we're going to change it to this i do not know why this happened and this actually guys it's agree with the subject and verb I do not know why this happened this is the correct ones and the other ones is incorrect grammatically error five we'll get down at the next train stations we'll get down at the next train stations so the word get down my dear viewers it makes this sentence incorrect wrong or grammatically wrong play grammatically and correct using a verb that do not agree with the subject okay so the right ones we have will get off at the next train station 
Okay, we'll get off at the next train stations. That's the right one, guys. The right sentence. It's agree with the verb or the subject and verb. We'll get off at the next train stations. Six. Your writing needs to be improving. Your writing needs to be improving. What makes this sentence incorrect? That was number six. Remember, guys, the word improving. Okay? This one. Improving word makes this sentence particular incorrect. The right ones is that we need to change improving. This is what we call with ing form of the verb gerund phrase. We are going to make it past form with it. This is what the result is. Your writing needs to be improved. Your writing needs to be improved. This is the right one. So we need to highlight the right sentence that agrees with a verb. Subjects and verb agreement. That was number six. Seven. The gold is a kind of precious metal. So number seven, guys, when you read that, so it's sometimes that the gold is a kind of precious metal. So remember, the way what we call incorrect here is what we call using the gold. The gold is a kind of precious metal. So you read the word the. Okay, <clears throat> so with that, we are going to omit this to make the sentence correct. Here we go. This is the right ones, my dear viewers. Gold is a kind of precious metal. This is the right ones. Okay, gold is a kind of precious metals. Okay, that's the correct subject verb agreement so our subject here is gold and special verb is east eight why the postman did not come today why the postman did not come today so that's number eight so the words here that makes the sentence incorrect is that the postman did okay did not come Okay, so this is incorrect one. Why the postman did not come today? So the right ones we have, number eight. Why didn't the postman come today? Okay, why the postman come today? Or why didn't the postman come today? This is what you call the right one. Okay, we are going to highlight the then the postman. Okay, that's the right one's class. That was for number eight. Nine. I think I will never find someone as you. Again, look at class. What's the mistake? I think I will never find someone as you. Okay. So the word as makes this sentence incorrect. Okay? Instead of us, my dear viewers, we are going to change us to like. Okay? This is what we call the right ones. I think I will never find someone like you. Okay? That's the right, what you call verb. Okay? Subject I and then like verb. Right, my dear viewers? Hope you can follow. Try to follow. Please watch the video till the end of our discussion. 10. How much is the temperature? Oh my God. Try to analyze it, my dear viewers. How much is the temperature? So by using this with how much, that means to say you are asking uh, what you call the amount or like that. So this quietly and correct sentence instead of how much 
we are going to change how much to what is the temperature instead of how much we're going to change what is the temperature this is the right one next the last number guys for our what's called motivation process are you a seller mind are you a seller mind okay so the word a seller remember my dear viewers this is what you call quietly incorrect okay so are you a zeller might that's an incorrect words using a zeller instead seller means salesman referring to a salesman are you a salesman my okay that's the right once okay whereas the other it's incorrect sentences okay hope my dear viewers you can follow our discussion today about how to identify or how to highlight the correct ones and identify the incorrect one sentences okay again this is very much imp important why we discuss that this is quite a competitive class remember in doing an exams or in taking an exams we must read very thoroughly the questions because sometimes it might be confusing for us how we are going to uh, arrange subject verb agreement so when the subject is singular our verb major viewers must be singular also when the subject is plural our verb also must be in a plural form okay hope my dear viewers could learn a lot from our teaching today about incorrect and correct sentences once again see you on my next video guys if you have any questions or suggestions please comment down below and don't forget to hit the notification bell icon so that you're updated in our latest tutorial Hope to see you guys again. Bye-bye and thank you.